Merry Christmas everybody. It's December 25th and we are headed back into the Washita National Forest and we'll video some of our trip on the way. We want to get out of the house and just enjoy some of this beautiful area again. Ashley and Remington's inside the Jeep and right now we're on Crystal Park Road so I'll set up a action camera to get some of our road that we travel and we'll see what all we can find to share with y'all thanks for following along and hope you're having a merry christmas in this video we have left highway 27 and turned east onto crystal park road this road will lead to crystal springs recreation area this area has some very nice dispersed campsites. It has a pit toilet. There's a nice spring, crystal spring, running behind the campsites with a, a nice dam. And as the water flows over the dam, you have a nice fall as the water flows. If there's not a lot of rain, that will be limited. You can swim in this area. We have been in this area before and we do have another video on our channel about Crystal Springs Recreation Area. And we really enjoy this area. We did include some action cam footage on this adventure. And I will be breaking it down into two or three videos, this being the first video. We leave Crystal Springs after we check it out a little bit and head east. And this trip is going to end up having us on Hickory Nut Mountain. We're going to be at the Vista Overlook and we will check out Hickory Nut Campground. There's also places such as Collier Springs, Twin Creek Crystal Mine, and a few trails like Crystal Scenic Trail, Lake Washita. Vista Trail and others. We will touch base on some of these throughout the videos as we reach each of those sections. Now we missed some stuff and we didn't show each and every dispersed campsite we passed because there were several and if we showed everything that was just amazing on this trip we'd still be out there recording. So we just touched base on some of the specifics and as we make the next videos we will share more. But I hope you enjoy this adventure and like I said it's probably going to be two or three videos. You will see the road conditions. There's a lot of hills there is some climbing and elevation there's some valleys there's creeks everywhere beautiful views and it's just an awesome area to explore and this is a great day trip even if you're not planning on camping uh, i would highly recommend this trip if you're in the area uh, we did make the trip we spent all day out and we did get home before dark and uh, as you know it's very cold but we really enjoyed the Jeep Cherokee Trailhawk on this adventure. We really love the heated seats and heated steering wheel in this vehicle. And look forward to making a lot more trips in it. So let's get on with this video a little bit. And uh, you may hear from me in a bit. This is our first stop. It's Crystal Springs Campground. We've been here before. Very nice area. And you can camp here for free. And it has pit toilets. Or a pit toilet, I should say. Which when we come to these kind of places, we always bring our own. But uh, when we're camping, that is. But a real nice spring. And you can swim in here. Not real deep right now. 
as you can see it goes quite a ways down that way there is somebody camping here really nice area we're not going to spend a lot of time here because it is cold and we are just out exploring because we wanted to get out of the house yeah and Ashley's going on about these huge. acorns here look they're really big for comparison that's my hand yeah very nice area that's where we came in and we're headed back to the right from here and we're going to end up on uh, hickory nut mountain So the road conditions are not in bad shape at all right now. Now these road conditions can change depending on weather, how much this road has traveled. There could be some mud and low water crossings depending on the weather. And as you can see there is a lot of dirt mixed in with this rock so it could be muddy and uh, if it's wet you could have a dirty vehicle the time you're done time we're doing this as you can see everything's dry and all we had to deal with was some dust but there's plenty of creeks and stream crossings and as you see here there's uh, bridges going across some of these creeks provide some good pictures and views as you're adventuring along this route we really enjoyed coming through here and hope that if you do this adventure you'll enjoy it too it won't be long up ahead we're going to run into a dispersed campsite and that's where we're going to end this video 
Uh, it'd also be a great place to go ahead and set up camp and enjoy some daylight on this route before finishing it to Hickory Nut Vista Lookout or Campground. And if you wanted to make a weekender out of it, you could travel on up to uh, Hickory Nut Campground and stay the night there. Plenty to do up there. There's walking trails, or I should say hiking trails, and uh, great views, and fire pits, picnic tables, and pit toilets. So you be sure you want to check that out when you get up there. But I just want to touch base on the road conditions. You know, it, a lot of rock in the road, a lot of gravel. So it's nothing to be concerned about. Two-wheel drive can traverse this no problem. There are some spots that get kind of bumpy, but it's just a typical gravel road. This is the second camp spot past Crystal Springs campsite or camp area. This is just a campsite that you can pull into and there's plenty of room to come down here and camp. It does look like you could manage with the ground tent if you wanted to. You know, someone made a little bench here. You got a fire pit over here. And you're right alongside this creek. Not a whole lot of water running in right now. You do have this creek here. A lot of rock. And it flows around past your site right here. Big old concrete thing is dumped in right here. And then it winds on around back that way. Nice little campsite. Got some ferns growing. And we're gonna travel on.